A new ATV trail celebrated its grand opening today. The new Crow Wing County Southern Loop ATV Trail is a recreation connector trail that was established to provide access to multiple trails and businesses. And as our Chelsea Brown tells us, it's part of a bigger plan to provide opportunities for diverse recreation areas for the public to enjoy. For us, it's uh, been 10 years in the making to get here. And 10 years later, Daryl Palmer is now seeing the club's long-term vision they planned back in 2006 of an ATV connecting trail system come to life. What it does for us is it, it allows people to ride from Fort Ripley to Pine Center trail system and it connects those systems back to Brainerd so people can have access to motels and gasoline and you know, food, those kind of area activities that they want to go to. And as well, uh, our goal longer term, of course, is to extend that system some way, somehow, to the north and also further off to the uh, east to get us to the Mille Lacs Lake area. The trail was approved as a recreation trail system back in 2011 by the Crow Wing County Board and followed with a grant approval in 2012. With two years of prep and three years of construction, the trail is now rideable through the month of November. The clubs were looking for a way to try and make those connections um, so that there's not isolated trails. We knew there were businesses and communities that wanted that commerce and that connectivity and folks to ride in a safe, responsible way. So. Um, this was the start of that. With less public land in Southern Crow Wing County and more roads, this particular trail is all about connecting communities. The 52 mile loop includes the Fort Ripley ATV Trail, Fort Ripley Connector, and Pine Center ATV Trail. It really provides an area for uh, businesses to get connected, folks to recreate on trails that are well managed, well signed, and well enforced in a, in a positive way to get people outdoors and just really enjoy what we think is Minnesota's favorite place, Crow Wing County. But most importantly, it's finally an opportunity for people to get out and ride. On safe and designated trails. In Brainerd, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. Development of the trail occurred in earnest in 2012 through 2014. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.